and sometimes the back shoulders and certain times throwing the ball, you, you want to underthrow it. Yeah. Um, the, the one down the left side that Pittman made a really nice play on, I, I thought wasn't a great throw. It was just a really good play by the by the uh, kid. But mm -hmm. the, the one to the right side where he was truly one-on-one -on -one and we, we back shouldered him, I thought that was a good spot for the ball. He put it in a place where only our guy could catch it. Yeah. And, you know, again, Michael made a really nice play and ran it in for a touchdown. So, you know, yeah, there's there's things we got to get better on. And, and, you know, it may not have been a perfect throw, but at the end of the day, you give really good players a chance to make a play. That's your job at quarterback. With Utah, they have a really good run defense. I yeah. haven't looked really closely at, at the numbers. So it's going to, you know, it's going to be a challenge. Yeah. Is, 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 is there a possibility – this is probably, I mean, I could answer my own question. Do you guys could throw the ball 65 times in a football game? Uh, I hope not 65. <laughs> I, hope, I hope it's not that many. Um, again, you watch, watch the film. They play one high pretty much every snap. Yeah. There's not a lot of running lanes in there. When you're, when you're a one-back, 11, 12 personnel offense, and they play with that many guys in the box, that, that's what they're doing. They're trying to stop the run, and you got to throw the football uh, and force them into some of their two high coverages. And, and that's the – the kind of cat and mouse game you play as coaches yeah. is if they're going to play one high, yeah, we got to throw the football. If they go to their two high stuff, that's when we got to run the football. It's, you know, sometimes we make it a lot harder than it really is, but that is pretty much as simple as that. That's, you know, when they have an extra guy in the box, you can't block that guy. Mm -hmm. I don't care how good of run blocking we have, you can't block seven guys if you only have six guys in the box. Yeah. And uh, so, you know, that's the cat and mouse game we'll play this weekend. And, uh, you know, like I said, at the end of the day, our goal is to win the football game. So we're going to do whatever we can to win. With, with the receivers that you do have, which, and you have Devin Williams is progressing nicely, and you have obviously Stu and, and Bonds and Pittman, but isn't this almost like a, a defense that with your receivers you feel like you have a huge advantage? Yeah, no, we're, we're, we feel like we have really good skill guys on the outside. And uh, again, that's, that's our job. When you play quarterback at SC, that's your job, is put the ball in a spot where our really good players can make a play. And uh, multiple times on Saturday we did that, and a couple times on Saturday we didn't. Um, I'd like to do a better job this week. Uh, I think number 13 for Utah, their, their free safety is probably the best defensive football player in our whole conference. Okay. So it, it, that will be a challenge, not allowing him to get to certain throws. Yeah. So, you know, it, it, it'll be a tough challenge. Uh, I think we're up to it. And, um, you know, when we have to throw the football to win the game, we need to go do it, and hopefully we'll be able to run the ball a little better as well. Did you think you made – you want you go ahead. Yeah, you can get. It. Did you think you, you, you made at least made progress offensively though that, uh, against? Uh, yeah. You know, as far as executing, I thought there were some good things. Um, you know, still making too many mistakes, uh, and, and that starts at quarterback. You know, that when you when you're the quarterback, you have to make everybody right. It's yeah. your job to manage it. You know, that when we talked about it in fall camp, it's our job to manage the offense first. So we got to get it right in our room first, and then we'll get everybody else right. Then, but that squarely falls on me. So it feels like the, the passing offense has been working in chunk plays for a lot of the recent half of the season, where it's really moving based on big 20, 30 yard yeah. gains as far, instead of the more methodical think and yeah. dunk game. Is that kind of just the way it's been, like what's been working, or are you specifically trying to work as like that well, being we, your identity? We, you as a know, no, 